having your period is like already like it's, it feels like there's a sword mm. like shoving up your vagina right yeah, yeah. so it's like why would you want an actual sword up your vagina hey guys welcome to another episode of keeping it real my name is emily and i'm michelle i'm kimberly i'm poppy i'm corinne i'm sam and today's topic is love and sex intertwined spicy Okay, so should sex come before marriage? <laughs> yes. Yes. One hundred percent. I let's also hear it from yes. some. Do a vote. Do a vote. I uh, need dick before think, the ring. I think no, but I <laughs> I couldn't help it, and then it happened. Okay. Okay. Sure. Yeah. How about you, Sam? I think it's a must. Okay. Because of, yes. It's great for you to bond your partner. Okay. Yeah. I think you need to try before you commit to someone. Right. So yeah. three yeses and one like a maybe. Mm. Not sure. Uncertain. Already happened. Oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah. on, but but you think it should not be the case. Uh yeah, I think it shouldn't. Okay. Mm. Yeah. But now now after ten years, I think it should. Oh. Okay. Now generation different. So okay. I think yeah. try already know know the length. Uh, I mean um. <coughs> sorry sorry. Ah <laughs> uh, the size. Oh no no I mean um like the 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 after do already then must must hug right. Then if never hard, right? Then you know this is not the one for you. Huh? Uh, hard, 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 So like hard. post, yeah, post yeah. <laughs> treatment. Yeah, okay, I kind of agree. Cause I mean, like, can you imagine, like, if you don't? I think like sex is a big part of a relationship. You must have sexual chemistry and everything. But can you imagine if like you don't fuck the person before you get married to them, and then after you get married to them, you realize that mm, oh my god, we don't match sexually. You're stuck to that dick for life, bro. <laughs> Yeah, bro. Like, what if like they were gonna come right, and then like they need to smell our feet before they like shoot? Oh my god, that's very <laughs> fucked up, bro. I wouldn't <laughs> want that. Yeah, uh, that that shit. I'm not wearing that ring, bro. This, I'm out, bro. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Agree. So, there's weird fuckers out there. Just fuck before yeah. you get married. Or like if they have some like weird kink, like mm, I'm into that's necrophilia. Weird. Can we like look at some dead people while we fuck? <laughs> Can you imagine marrying a guy like that? Oh like, my god! Like you oh marry their kink, you marry their kinks, you marry their, their 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 body, this and that. Like, I mean, divorce is a thing, but like, it's a hassle. So yeah, like, yeah. Then imagine you got a key that that fucker. Have sex before get, getting married, but then how soon mm. is too soon? How long do you think you need to be with someone before you like have sex with them? Because like, I mean, we're saying now that you should do it before marriage, but like, how soon is too soon? You know. <clears throat> I don't think there's a too soon. I think it could even happen before you fall for the person. Then you fall for the person when that happens, you know? Oh, okay. I think there isn't like a definite of when it could happen. But if we were to talk about like dating terms, right? Like you meet someone, you have the intention to date. Maybe a month? I think no after fucking a month, way. I think after a month is Three okay. months. I think one month is enough to like, you know, get to meet someone. It's okay, he's a guy, there. he's a guy. All guys think like one month, uh, first day is okay. Okay, <laughs> I don't like speak for all guys, but personally myself, I think like one month is actually okay already. Okay, okay. So judging from like in the comments, right, does it mean like if let's say you find someone that you can have good sex with, right, you think she's the one already or like he's the one? I mean, good sex is a big part of it. It's a big part of it. You're committing right. to her, right? Then you're committing right. to seeing her every day, then I you know, see, it's fun to have fun. Right. So far, how's the journey been? <laughs> okay, it's been, it's been it's been okay. It's not been the right? best, not the best, but All right, okay. Okay. oh man. Yeah. yeah, I know, right? It's like, Aww, <laughs> so cute, right? Girls, come on, let's do better. Let's do better man. Pimp Sam out. Might not be the girl's problem though. I mean, oh, that's true. I mean, Maybe it's dick for. <laughs> I mean, uh, <clears throat> never mind, like, uh, mm. But it's also the case when people say like you know um experience. <laughs> Then you know better and then you learn better, then you can have a better yeah, chemistry with like the person next, mm-hmm. right? So But what's to say you can't learn with the person that you're with, you know? That like, is true too? Yeah. Yeah. But how about Bobby? Do you think right if let's say you met someone and then you don't really have like say good sex, right? Mm-hmm. But then you've been with him for like quite some time and then he tried to spice things up. Throughout the relationship, do you think that will work also? I think it's cute if he puts in like effort. Right. But if he tries too hard and he's just like not there, then I don't think it can work. I feel like it needs to be natural. Right. Like natural mm-hmm. chemistry. Yeah. Like you can't force anything. Yeah. 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 True. I just want someone to like treat me like a rag though. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm like, I'm joking. I, I fucking hate subs. 
Like, Submiss- if you like give me uh. like the uwu vibe, right? You're mm. fucking out of the Or like, or like you pull out and like they don't know what to do. They're like, oh, 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 like, oh, 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 <laughs> yeah, I can't oh like, like I'd rather be the one Let's just choke him Yeah, like, I, I did But it's so fucking like It's so fucking bad Like, no mm, Oh my god Say, dude, I had this guy once You like he, No, no, no <laughs> Not that But like, it was very strange Like, you like call me And then like, like Yes, same. Tell tell me that my dick is big Like, tell me that my dick <laughs> is huge Like, or like Oh my god Tell me that like You love it And I'm like um, Your dick so know. fucking big. I'm, I'm not a liar, but like it's, it's not that I was like not not that I had to lie or anything, but it's just like it's just weird, you know, like when they ask you to do these kind of things. Like, Why does he need validation from you? Maybe he just felt funny. Like he just felt. Yeah, maybe but he's like, watching something. Uh, it's maybe. Perhaps. It, it's, watching it's, her. it's like me asking a guy like, oh my god tell me my tits are huge tell me you love my mummy milkers in your fucking face when I don't have mummy milkers it's like the fucking same thing like it's just weird like why would you ask me to do that you know it's just <laughs> and over the phone too <laughs> like <laughs> but yeah. I like phone sex yeah it's like hot yeah I like it too oh, but it's so. like but like not when it's like not when how it's so. like how would you react if a guy was like oh, can you tell me that my dick is huge your dick's so fucking huge <laughs> Yes, anything for you, so... <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Wait, wait, I want to ask something. Go ahead. Have you asked a girl to say that of you? No, I never. But the girl got asked me to, um, you know, compliment back on text. She asked like, hey, is my, you know, jugs big? Or whatever. Then, just affirm her, yeah, it's big. <laughs> Even if it's not big, because, uh, you know... That's very nice of you, actually. It's your... Like, <laughs> I you're don't doing, want to start yeah. trouble, so like... I feel like you shouldn't lie say. when it comes to sex, though, like... But yeah. I mean, maybe he felt that way. Oh, my teeth big. Like, no, but no. he just said he doesn't want to hear. That's right. First of all, I feel like if you give them the what they want to hear, right, they'll please you better. Oh, they'll perform better. Yeah, yeah, they'll perform better if you please them better. So they'll do what you're true. Yeah, so give them what they want. But it's kind of like a foreplay yeah. too, right? It's kind of, kind of, I guess. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. Actually, sometimes I think words, I mean, if you're a words person or a language person, then maybe you'll fall for like the foreplay of affirmation. Love bomb. Yeah. Then you bomb her back. <laughs> Snow bomb. <laughs> okay, so for, for you guys, how soon is too soon? I feel like if I want to be in a committed relationship with this guy, like at least like, yeah, she said three months. Three months. Okay, but yeah. if it's like a FWB kind of Then it doesn't matter. Like. So first day, can Yeah. Okay. Actually, mm. for me, right, I mean like I would like at first look, regard the person like an FWB. Okay. Until I start falling. Do you think that you're a gentleman when it comes to... At the start, yeah, I would say I'm a gentleman unless they have like, you know, special type of kings. Okay, we see how it goes, how the mood goes, okay, but I prefer to be a gentleman for most start. But I also like not being a gentleman, you know. Okay, I get what you mean, I get what you mean. When's the time that you're not a gentleman, you think? When, I think we're more committed in a relationship, right? When we're more committed in a relationship really and you know, we're more open to trying new stuff oh. like BDSM, etc. Furries. Oh, that's no, that's no, 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 that's no, furries. That's nice. That's nice. Animals, animals. No, okay, I'm not into that kind of stuff. Furries, but, um, uh, furries yeah. means they love to dress up in like fursuits and like woof woof. <laughs> yeah, but I don't like that kind of stuff. I like yeah. normal stuff. BDSM, that's when, you know, things change a bit, but yeah, no furries, thank you. Mm. Like for the girls, right? Do you guys like your counterpart to be like, a gentleman or do you want them to be like or like what's a, a good mix a of like being a gentleman or, and like being a fucking dom daddy oh my god i think i like gentlemen i like soft boys yeah. kind of okay. i like kind of. i like it when the guy practices aftercare yes yeah. same because some guys they just fucking like dip yeah and i honestly like i feel like a, an object that's so yeah. rude that way like truth is out but like when when we are fucking like oh my god like treat me like an object lah like yeah uh, ah! sorry 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 <laughs> I feel like I mean us as females we can tell the guy what we need as well but sometimes I feel like they don't know yeah. no but the thing is it's not hot it's not hot if I have to sit there and be like can you please like yeah, slap like- me. <laughs> Like, just do it. You know what I mean? Like, we want, we, like, isn't it not very hot if, like, you have to tell the guy to do everything? Like, they should have a bit of an instinct. Yeah, oh my god, I like it when they are more, like, like they just, like, initiative. shove you in different positions. You yeah, know I mean? like, don't, like, are. um, should we do, you know what, okay, wait, I don't know if I should say this because it's technically not my story, but, like, I had a friend who told me, right, her ex would, like, give her a briefing before and after sex. So, before sex, like, 
he will sit her down and be like, okay, so the first 15 minutes we will be doing in doggy position. The next, and then maybe we'll try like missionary for like five minutes. And then after that, um, I'm going to finish on your back. Like he will brief her and then they'll fuck. Isn't that so weird? No, it was weird. It can last longer than five minutes. Right. <laughs> I want to ask you, Sam. Okay. As a guy, if let's say you encounter any like, you know, unpleasant experience with um, sex, so how would you generally break off like say or tell or would you even tell the girl? I mean, yeah, I would tell the girl. In fact, um, you know, I had an ex before and then you know I voiced out to her, but she seemed pretty offended. Okay, uh, she wasn't okay. that nice of a person so uh, she was quite childish as a person. Mm-hmm. Then we ended okay. up breaking up in mm-hmm. like year one, which was three years back. Okay, and how then did we it? We actually how did broke it up using a PowerPoint <laughs> presentation. Okay, okay. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. It wasn't just because of bad sex, like she wasn't okay. you know that nice of right, a person. Right, 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 right. Okay. I actually consulted some friends like hey, okay. you how should I break up? And then mm. they were like, uh you know she tried PowerPoint presentation, <laughs> then that's what we did. I created a PowerPoint presentation. No. How many pages was it? I was 20 like, pages? That's like 20 pages. Whoa, that, that's a lot! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I no, like, I wouldn't sit through that shit. Yeah. Right? Okay, okay. It, like, was down to, it was down to details. Like, there were some charts, some graphs, some pointers, recommendations. Oh okay. Can I see it? Can I see yeah, it? No, I deleted it because I deleted it. Just okay. in case, you know, I don't want to keep it around. Did, did she sit throughout the whole thing? Or did she try and up and leave? She read through everything. She read through everything. Wait, no, so you didn't present it? No, I sent it over over text. Oh. Yeah, they told me to present it. Okay, okay. I thought it's at first. No, no, like, they wanted me to go to the class and then like you know um present the whole powerpoint to her but like <laughs> i think that's, that's a bit harsh, a bit harsh even for a not so nice person but right, so i just right. said no but how, how was her reaction then i mean she was like uh you know we shouldn't break up but then i give the reasons why okay. yeah and then i was like i, I mean, accept your presentation yeah it's not just <laughs> she didn't say she accepted it she kind of had to she kind of had to right, 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 right. fuck you sam <laughs> nah, man, not me, but, but yeah Fuck you, cool, cool, presentation. Cool, cool. Bye. How about how about the girls? Like, if you guys have like you know bad bad sex, you know how how would you break it off, or would you even tell the guy about it? I endure. I just endure. <laughs> I don't. That's the worst. Yeah. That's but you're okay with like. That's so you're committing to like bad sex for the rest of your life. No, but okay, you know, because usually, right, by the time the sex doesn't work out, I kind of in my head, I kind of know that the relationship isn't gonna work out. Mm. So I so okay. girls, you know, you know how this works, but like. I start entering the detaching myself phase. And then by the time I'm completely emotionally okay, detached, that's when I break up. Yeah. Mm. Okay. You know what I mean? Sounds like that's a long process. So I get over the relationship yeah. before I break it off. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Right, right, right. How about you, Corinne? Um, Any like ways to you know tell the person or the guy? Um, um, you, you start first. <laughs> I feel Don't like you have to tell him in a nice way. Like maybe like right after, then you're like, oh, how do you feel? And then you can say like, oh, maybe like you could have done this better in that way. Mm. But I don't know. I like I personally, I haven't done that before. Mm. So I wouldn't know. Because I feel like it might come up quite rude also, especially if you really love the person. Yes. It's really hard. Like, I don't know how I would feel if someone like gave me constructive feedback, you know? Mm. Yeah. No, especially if the guy, right, he's like feeling it and then you're just not feeling it. Yeah. Then you're like, um, it's a bit awkward. Actually, I've had constructive yeah. feedback before. Oh, cool. Yeah, like yeah, sure. with like, <clears throat> like the, <laughs> with like glocking, uh, like, you know, sucking oh. like glock. So basically, like my first, I mean, but my, my first guy, uh, like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think last time I didn't know how to suck cocks. Mm. So, <laughs> um, so like the time like I didn't know how I right, then like when we I was doing it, he was like, "Don't use your teeth." Okay. <laughs> that always happened. So that's when I was like, "Oh, okay, I won't use my teeth." And then that's when he started enjoying it. Oh. Mm. Yeah, see, that, I mean that that's something I appreciate because mm. like if you communicate with me like while we are having it, it's like I'll get you what you want, and then mm-hmm. like if you are okay with it, I'll you you give me what I want. Yeah. Yeah. If I tell you not to fucking rub me, then don't rub me. Then mm. I'll enjoy it better. Also. Okay. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Fair, so it's fair. like if you don't want me to use my teeth or like bite your head off, then yeah, I won't. Ah. I will use my, <laughs> I will use my tongue more long, like you know something like that. Okay. Mm. Yeah, you know, I heard a thing that like, if you see like a guy's face the first time they get sucked off by an ego, right? They always <laughs> wet wings. Because our head is down there, right? So you cannot see. But like, they're always like, because apparently we always use our teeth. First time. Oh, really? No way. I, well, seriously, I don't know that. Yeah, apparently. I don't know. Like, I, I asked around, like, apparently it's true. So. Yeah, I think it's true, it's true. Or like, if the guy's face never react all right, means it's okay. Or you'll be like, Ugh. Or like, there's no reaction at all right, it's just a bad drop. So what's a good oh. reaction? <laughs> 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 I think any reaction, right? Like, 
does have to be smiling. Show that, show that. Okay, you know what? Like, fucking smiling at you when you're fucking like, you're like, like, yeah. Like, you know, um, I think any reaction in general is good, but like, if there's no reaction, all right, this is like, it's just not working. And if it's like shrinking while you do it, right, this is a bad job. Shrinking? Yeah, I like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, it's a bad job also. Have you ever shrunk? Oh, yeah. shrinking. Yeah, yeah. yeah I got, got like, yeah. They just got turned off. Yeah, it's like, you get turned off halfway, yeah. so like, it's a bad job done. I think that's where the And like, at what point do you guys, <laughs> like, at what point do you guys feel like, comfortable giving like, feedback? I mean, it's not like, you give them a survey after sex, right? Like, no lah, must do it During debriefing. Yeah, like, no lah, I do it during, during yeah, like, I give feedback. Ah, during? Then, uh, you won't like, go in the mood, man. No, what the fuck? I'll just right. say lah. Oh my right. can you do this? Can you do that? No lah, like, I think it can be done like when you are cuddling and then you're like, oh, you know, right? Yeah, I think that's a like, better way. Yeah. Like, not doing sex lah. Doing sex is like demoralizing. Hey, do this, do no, that. but like, if you do it in a hot way, like, uh, like, can you like, uh, yeah. kiss my neck? Or like something like, but you don't, oh, that's nice, don't yeah. do it like, no, obviously I'm saying it in a very like, monotone, right. m- monotonously right now, but like, if you do it like, like, <laughs> performatively doing sex, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah, right. That's true. Yeah. Really? How do you yeah. do it? I don't know, I'm just like, honestly, I have like them lot of fucking fuck ups during like sex. Mm. Like, there was this one time, right, I had a like, full ass meal, then I was sucking this guy off, uh-huh. and I vomited on him. Oh, oh my god. god. Like, on his entire crotch. Okay, same. Yeah, he went soft shit. <gasps> <laughs> but, like, he, but then, like, you know, we kind of communicated through everything. I feel like it's I'm more comfortable lah, like sharing and like just if you're asking like when would I feel comfortable telling like my partner if like you know how I want things to be done, I think I'll just tell them straight away. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like if I'm having sex with you, I must be comfortable with you already. So it's That's true. You're being very intimate and vulnerable yeah. with them. You're literally showing them things that legally you're not supposed to. Yeah. <laughs> legally, okay. Yeah. Really what legally you're supposed to. What do you guys think about like body counts then? Yeah. Poppy. Like, does it matter hey, to you? Want to go one round, everyone body yeah. count. Yeah, body count. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Fingers enough or not? <laughs> single digit, single digit. In, on the low side. Right. Yeah. Same. Cool, cool. Same. Same. Uh, single digit. Very good for my age. Really. <laughs> just two. Just two. Because he's very young. Number two. <laughs> no, but but, like, but legally, it's so, I mean, legal lah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Legal yeah, 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 um, we are all single okay. digits. Any burdens? Mm. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> How is that single digit? <laughs> yeah, okay. So does body count matter to you guys? It's too low. Like, if it's like a zero, I'll be a bit worried. Because I don't want to teach him. Like, that's such a turn off oh, for me. Yeah. Okay. Like, imagine you have to teach the guy what to do. But like, you get to set the bar, you know? I feel like it's really <laughs> such a privilege if I like, take your virginity. Mm, I set the bar. <laughs> that's right. That's true. Like, and, and to know that like, no one has ever fucked him before, it's like... <laughs> You're the first one, it's like, gang. I think I have a number to my limit. Mm-hmm. Like maybe for me, right, I don't think I will like consider, like, or maybe take into consideration of the partner if this person's body count is more than five. Mm-hmm. Okay. okay. I don't know why, it's just like personal preference. But what's just the difference between the four and five? Yeah. Like, if four and five, then what's the difference? If he exceeds five, then I'm like, what the fuck lah? And four? What the fuck? Like, okay lah, I'll be over five lah. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I mean, no lah, but like, I mean, I have met people that have like body counts higher than like a hundred. Mm. Yeah, yeah, fucking insane, yeah. and like higher than like or like even more than ten. Like you, what? you said two right, two digit right, like, more than ten. No, two, like two, two. Like two. Holy shit, you have yeah. two. Yeah, two. I'm not like you know super. Oh my god, I'm not two digit. I, I wish it's no, it's not two digit. Like just like wish. Yeah. No, no, sorry, not I wish. Just two. Just two. <laughs> oh, but yeah. Uh, I mean, for me, two digits is a bit like muchy already. Mm. Yeah, right. Cause I never know what this guy is thinking. Oh, you, the yeah. thing is, you never know what the guy is thinking during sex. Yeah. Cause you know, f- someone told me right. I have this one person that told me that, you know, while fucking right, the guy will actually think about math equations so that they can <laughs> last longer. Huh? Who? What? Oh, yeah, yeah, actually, I think that's true. Yeah, that makes sense. No, 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 no. I said I never done it before, but now I think about it, right? Like, sense. think about like math equations or like science That's or like things. Shrink, ma. Not shrink, no, 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 it's not related to that. But if you think about all those kind of stuff, right? Like, things that will distract you away from the situation, right? You so can last, actually last, longer, yeah, right? last longer. I mean, maybe. See, I, I, just about it, I just thought about it, I just thought about it. The girl over there, like, squeeze the kids now. Yeah, just. But actually, it makes sense though. Yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. sense. Even for girls, uh, I think it makes sense. No, eh, I only think about the guy and the guy only, yeah. eh? Yeah. Oh, yes. okay. Maybe I'll want to be a girl. Because when have guys ever made us come? Period. 
Actually, that is a very fair thing. point. No, no, no. How about y'all? Do you think body counts matter? Mm. It matters. Like, mm. you want it to be higher or lower? Uh, I think around 10 is okay. Oh, that's oh, quite high. Wow. Oh, 10 uh, uh, Is it because you want like, them to be more experienced? So, like, but how old like, are you now? Oh, so, I, like, I am uh, 30. 30. Okay, so yeah. 10 is like reasonable. It's, it's okay for my age. Mm, yeah. yeah. Okay, mm. yeah. Because that matters also. Like, the older you are, the more likely yeah. you are to have more experience. So, yeah, okay. Uh, so one is too little, five is too much for my age. One is too little. One is too little. No, okay. He's only twenty-one. Okay, so it's like uh, age, like baby, like that. <laughs> so one if is too they little. never had it before, then you know, five is too much. Okay, I prefer if they at least had one partner before, like one encounter before, because I don't like the whole taking opportunity. But don't take responsibility. You be careful, really yeah. <laughs> I'm not in the whole blood thing. I don't like the uh, whole blood thing. Oh. Yeah. And you take away the virginity, right? you make a first impression. Actually, like, I actually impression. I heard a lot of guys say right, like the first time if like if it's the first time for the girl, right, it's actually very traumatizing for them because it's like it's more difficult to penetrate, right? And then you're like very yeah. stressful, like how 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 that is become a very like. I mean, it depends on the guy as well. Like the guy, not all girls bleed on their first. Mm, that is true. Yeah. Yeah. It's not a mass method. Like they will bleed. The cherry pop. Oh. You go buy cherry. Pop. If their hymen is like, like very flexible or like they are turned on enough, it doesn't. Mm. Did you That's bleed? True. Yeah, I did. I did. Uh, I mean, I did it in the toilet, lah. So. Oh, oh wow. Gang. <laughs> it was not very romantic. <laughs> like like just a public toilet, like. Yeah, very sad, yeah. Not just public toilet. Mm. McDonald's. Right. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> what if like your partner doesn't doesn't see in that way? Like you know, there's like people who are like say asexual, demisexual, you know those kind of things, right? So so how would you navigate if you really love this person but they are not really into the sex thing? I think, nah. Yeah. Not really. Yeah. Uh, I think it depends on how important sex is to you as well. Mm. Like if it's so not it that was, important, then you can compromise. That's right? true. I think it fits the love, the love language as well yeah. because you know it, it kind of fits into physical touch and affection. Oh, right, right. So I feel that if the person does not like meet that standard or like yeah. meet that expectation, I don't think that that relationship can even work oh. out in the very first place. That means place. you're sexually incompatible already. That yeah, that's true. Yeah, but I, I have a friend who's like in a long term relationship who hasn't like had their virginity taken, and they've been going on for very long and still very strong. Are they Christian? Yeah, are they Christian? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I was yeah, I guess so. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, okay. They left like, the room for then. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, so I think maybe sex isn't that important in like lasts. some mm. relationships. No, but yeah. if you have like a religion binding you, mm. right? I mean, yeah. it's a strong motivation for both of them. Mm. So, yeah. Actually, we might never know. Maybe. But yeah. to be honest, <laughs> like, I feel like I'm not really a very sexual person. I, I would consider myself kind of demisexual. Like, what turns me on, right, is like more of like, let's say, smell. Or like a talent that he's like some somewhat doing right. Then I'm mm. like, oh, I feel the not. Mm. But not like sexually, like wow, oh, his body or his like look or his dick mm. or even whatever. Yeah, so it's like. Wait, so a talent turns you on. Sorry. Yeah, yeah a talent turn. A, a talent. Like, talent like, any talent or like. Not any talent lah. Like the one that turns. Okay, what do you like? like? What what what? Uh, what like wearing okay. nicely, <laughs> like properly dressing yourself. Oh, that's a talent. Yeah. That's a talent. That's a talent. That's a talent. That's a talent. <laughs> Having good fashion. What? Talent. It's true. Talent. It's true. Like like I mean, it's like it's random things that turns me on. Like I I'm not turned on by like sexual attributes. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So let's know more about like you know each of your individual like sex um favorite position and how regular do you think one should have sex. Let's start with Sam. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, so for positions, right, I'm more or less okay with anything, but I like to be the one. Okay, that that position, right? I'll prefer it if I'm putting in more effort, like. So you're top. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so basically, I'm top because I like to, you know, be in control. Be in control the oh. whole sex, <laughs> right? And what's the second question? How regular? I think once in two days is good. Once in two once days. Once in two days, that's yeah. quite regular. Once in two days. About three <laughs> times a week. Yeah, three okay. or four times a week would be great. So well, he's still Whoa. young. He's still yeah. young. Time uh, I don't think. I don't think he's because of young. Uh, it's it's that one. The hormones is there. Do you there. consider yourself having like a higher sex drive? I think I have the same sex drive as like everyone else in this room. Like you know, all the guys in this room. Like really? generally the same. Or maybe it's because of our ER. I don't know. But generally, guys I make a make some noise if you agree with him. Yeah, <laughs> 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 yeah but generally four times. Four times is good. Four times. Four is good. times a week is frequent. 
Really? I think it's okay. <laughs> like, I can hear people have sex like almost every single day. Like, that's Let, your Let's say you like. found the girl. Wow, a dream. But if you don't do much, then your brain can work better. Right? So you're not so smart. <laughs> wait, no, wait, I thought it's the other way around. They say, right, okay, I read online, I don't agree with it, but like, they, they say, like, um, you have more sex, right? You're able to think better, you feel healthier, you feel um, more confident. Yeah. Do you feel like you're smarter once you fuck? have fun? I mean, recently, not so much. Maybe I'm like a bit dumber recently, but you know, maybe because <laughs> oh, of the lack of sex, so yeah, like more sex. Yeah yeah, 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 so more sex means smarter. Okay, right? that's, that's Samuel's quote. More sex, more smarter. So yeah, more sex, smarter. <laughs> How about you, like, more sex, more calm. Okay, that's for you lah. More I mean, happy, and then, then the cheeks will glow on. Oh, so how regular do you think you should do it? Um, if can, or uh, as regular as possible. So like, as much as you can. Like mm, maybe day. like, once a day or something. Okay, oh, wow. Every oh single God. day. Wow. Oh like, okay like, not so, not so what. Maybe two times, breast one time. Okay. okay. Two okay. days, do one time. Mm. How about like, your favourite post? Uh, from the back. He, you he from the back or him from the back? He the back, he the back. <laughs> he the back. I, like, I like to be suck. I like the guy more dominant. Oh. So like doggy? Yeah, doggy. That kind, yeah, yeah, yeah. So embarrassing. <laughs> How That's about you? me? Yeah. Well, I haven't thought about it. Can we move on to Poppy first? Well, I'll think about it. <laughs> um, I'm a pillow princess. Oh. Yes! yes! <laughs> I like to be like, I like the guy to be dumb. Yes. And like, I'm so tired all the time. I don't want to be on top. Like, it's so tiring. Like, your legs get so tired. Yeah, yeah. And then they're just like, yeah. Mm. Mm. What was the other question? Sorry. Uh, how, how regular? regular? How regular? I feel like for me, once a week is like enough for me. Wow. Ooh. Yeah. I don't really have That's that actually, high of a yeah. sex drive. Mm. But like, once a week is fine lah. Yeah. Okay. Kim? Uh, honestly, I'm good with every position. Mm-hmm. Maybe it's not one that like, it's so fucking weird. Like helicopter. Wee, wee. Why is a helicopter? Dude, I don't want the one I'm fucking like not on the floor, not on the bed kind. Yeah, like like legit, my jumps like hanging. <laughs> on the, I don't. I cannot lah. Like, really. God, example, you guys try before. You try before a weird position that made you feel uncomfortable. No, it's just fucking like my core muscle pain. Yeah, like damn jala lah. Don't want lah. You know why would I want to do that? But um, any position is fine. I mean, my favorite would have been like doggy lah. No shit, mm. like. It's nice. And like, do you ever experience like the queefing? Like, yeah, I, all the time, all Dude, the time. In doggy, bro, like every single yeah. time I switch position after doggy, it's like. Bruh. Do you know it feels good for the guy that they queef? Like when really? we queef, yeah, because it's like when they're when their cock go in, right? That's like. Was it? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like <laughs> suction, is it? Yeah, it's like, it's like a lot of like texture, Vacuum. like a lot of like feelings, like cool and then warm and oh. then you know, yeah. I, I heard it's yeah. nice for the guy. Okay. And then yeah, how right. regular? Okay, how regular? So let me think. Yeah. It depends on my, my period cycle. Mm. It can go from like more than twice a day to like very high sex stress, yeah. yeah. Once a week. Oh, okay. Depends on my periods. Okay, wait, talking right. about period, wait, right? Yeah. I want to ask something. Like, just because I heard about it, about it before. Oh, yeah. So I hear from a lot of friends, right, that they have like period sex. Mm. Do you do it? No, 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 no. I'm not uh-huh. into the whole like period stuff. But oh, I heard, yeah, like, you don't like blood. Yeah, yeah, but I heard oh, like it has sex thing. when like all the blood is like coming mm-hmm. out and shit. Do you guys like try that? No, we do it in the shower. Yeah, do it in the shower. The most convenient. No, like, I like this. I don't like shower. What? I like it. I like it. I heard that. I feel like the water make it more. No, I, but it's I, very sensual. The yeah, water is like touching so slimy. Your... But the water like, is very slippery. Oh my god, bathtub, bathtub sex is so good. Yeah. You should try that. You should try. It's really I, I heard that like, um, what, where if you if a guy mm. fucks a girl on her period, right? Because there's so much more lubrication, mm. it feels like she's loose, or it's not as nice. Oh, but I don't know, I think it's different. But doesn't it like smell? I mean like period blood can't smell here. No, I mean, it doesn't smell. It smells like blood, lah. I mean Like as long as you're not like you're not like Heavy. Like eating her out, you know, right. while she's having a period. Yeah, oh, yeah, okay. Like no, but that's, it, that's like having a period like, and light period. Ma. Like if you're doing it during her light period times, right, then I think it shouldn't really matter because... Yeah, visual, every yeah. sailor sails the Red Sea, bro. Oh, oh my god, yeah, try yeah. it this once. Yeah. Huh? I don't, I don't want it. Why? It's I don't know, I'm just insecure. Yeah, right. I'm just insecure. Oh. No, I just ask the, I mean, ask the guy lah. Like but, if he's okay, I, I mean, yeah, yeah he'll treat me well. Okay, but yeah. I, I don't know where, like, for me, it's just personal preference that I wouldn't want them to, like, fuck me in my period. Mm. I mean, you know, having your period is, like, already, like, it's, it feels like there's a sword, mm. like, shoving up yeah. your vagina, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's like, why would you want an actual sword up your vagina? Mine doesn't hurt that bad. So oh, like, right. Maybe, okay. Maybe mine's I just. I don't get cramps. Right, right, right. You? <clears throat> like, I've had period sex once, and the guy got soft. 
Because he was oh. like, I'm so sorry, the iron, the iron smell is just not it for oh, me. I was yeah, like, okay. Maybe yeah. it's like someone <laughs> All you Black. sailors Not sailing the Red Sea huh? I see you guys Weak okay. <laughs> What happened to Blood, sweat and tears Yeah <laughs> <the> blood. <laughs> <laughs> blood, sweat and tears right? Okay so Your, your, your faith, faith post And how regular I am also Kind of like a pillow princess But like I don't know I, Okay I'm okay with any position But like In terms of how regular At least like Two to three times a week because I feel like like I want to feel hot and I want to feel desired, right? Mm. So like any less than that makes me feel a bit like mm, I mean not very hot to this end. Does that mean that you want the guy to initiate more because you want yeah, him no, to f- I don't mind initiating, but like it has to be like if I've been initiating for a while, right, then the guy has to reciprocate. Right, right, right. It can't always be me. Yeah, you, yeah. If it's always me, then it just feels like he you doesn't ever want to fuck him. Uh, fuck me, yeah. So not least, what are some of your sexual fantasies? Or like, let's get a little Let's get wild. Samuel, I want to know your fantasies. Let's get wild. Uh, think of you, uh, uh, a few. Don't steam me, uh. Don't steam now, uh. Don't cock steam, uh. So the first is like, wow, okay. So it's like when we're in formal, when we're wearing formal wear. So like, so like, when I'm wearing a suit or like, you know, I'm dressed nicely and then she's also dressed nicely, like, you know, you go poly, like... Like, nights. No, not, not <laughs> that much, like, okay. you know, presentation, like, in poly, right, you wear a presentation fit, right, that kind of fit, huh? like, shit, man, that kind of fit turns me on, man. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's like, it's like, a, it's like super classy but dirty. Yeah, yeah, in some sense, it's like, not too formal, so it's still kind of casual, like, that shit, like, the black skirt and the... <laughs> Ooh. You know, I thought like mm. that shit turns me on. So wait, school girl? What? Okay, no, school girls in general. It depends on who we're talking about as well. But you got uniform that and girls. no, not uniform. That's too young. Then uh, BDSM. Yeah, mm, okay. I would say recently I've grown a king or like a you know fantasy for BDSM because like. Do share, do share. What kind? The handcuffs one or like what kind? Or the handcuffs, spanking handcuffs. one? Yeah, a lot of handcuffs. Like, <laughs> you like I, to be handcuffed? No, not me, not me, not me. Like, oh, not you me. like to handcuff someone? Yeah, else. I like to handcuff someone else. Right, because right. like I said, I prefer being... Then what do you do after you handcuff her? Spank her? Yeah, a bit of that. A bit of that is good too. <laughs> have but... you tried before? No, I haven't tried before. <laughs> oh, they <laughs> said the fantasy mode. I'd like to try, like to try, you know. Okay. Yeah, yeah, just put it out there. Manifest it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Keep they the key lost properly. the key, you know, then they go hospital with the key. Fuck. Yeah. Oh my god. It's a real story. So, keep the key. Why the fake ones, ones are? Like so the key, like, I think they're excited. They show that they cannot find the key. It's not funny. Yeah, they don't solo. They say, why, why? Yeah, some like so fucking horny to the point they solo the key. Like, like this is a real story, like someone solo the key. Like, you yeah. didn't shit it I out watched, and then I watched some porn lah, and then like it was like this. I watched the porn and it was like that. Oh, you watched some weird stuff, man. Oh my god. May your fantasy come true. Thank you. Come see me, see me. My turn. Uh, I think. Uh, I. Uh, embarrassed to say, but I. I. It's okay. Just go for it as well as you get. I think I kind of like the the the, the choking. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I think choking yeah, is. Then, okay. You choke or people choke you? I I gonna. Mm. Oh you. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's okay, cool. Yeah. It's cool. It's cool. In, in a bit of. Yeah. Cause like our breath like very sexy right like. No, you know there's like a thing like apparently it's euphoric for girls to get choked because like mm. when they choke you right they're blocking oxygen to your head mm-hmm. so when they finally release it like you get a bit of euphoria yeah. like it's wow. like yeah. Science. yeah science cool let's go me mm-hmm. um I steam it okay 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 uh I like it when a guy chokes me, pulls my hair, smacks me, slaps my face. So, uh, oh my god! <laughs> yeah, literally anything that you can think of that's like mildly violent. Like not to the point I'm fucking bleeding lah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, but like I like it when I'm like degraded. Like the handprint, <laughs> the handprint still there at the time. Uh. Sorry? Like the handprint still in your butt. Yeah, that'd be so hot yeah. Then you know how like when you like so fucking like into it. Into it, right? you have you scratch the guy's back. Uh, oh. Then like when he turn around and suddenly all your scratch. Why is fucking wow, hot there? But I think not all guys in fantasy. Yeah. I steam. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Poppy? I like to be blindfolded. <gasps> I'm more like oh, sensual. Yeah. What's the aspect of the blindfolding that you like? Like you don't know like what to expect. So it's like the thrill. You, yeah, right? and then if he like brings like an ice cube and you're like blindfolded, oh. then you're like, oh my God. yeah, it's like, I like like 
the central feeling. Right, right, right. Yeah. But I feel like it's also because he's making effort to like yeah, correct. entice you. Mm-hmm. Learning, learning, learning. Cool. Uh, learning, learning. Learning, learning. <laughs> <laughs> but different girls, different expectations. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah, I think I'm pretty similar to Kim in the aspect, like similar taste. But like, uh, my but the main reason why I like that, or like, or like you know, I like him to like treat me like a rag doll. So like, put me like legit like damn dom daddy. Like you know, like just throw me in different positions. Right. Like, like cheating you like object. You know what I mean during sex. But then the main reason why I like that is because I feel very desirable. I don't know. I I guess I'm kind of a narc, like a narcissist. Okay. But like, like when they do that, it like makes me feel like oh, they're really desperate to have sex with me, or like they really love it. You know, like my I get turned on by my partners getting turned on. Same. Yeah. Same. Yeah. So the Same. more like they seem like they're into it, the more I'm like, oh my fucking god, yes. yes. But it makes sense though, yes. because like when you see someone enjoying it so much, you feel like you want to give it your all too. Consent, mm. guys. Okay. That is and true. What's yours? For me, yeah. Uh, well, it's very difficult for me. I really don't have any fantasy. When he, like to me, when he dresses well and he smells good. Oh uh, yeah, exactly. Like I mean, that kind or like he has. If he has a talent of like you know making his nails looks good. Oh, <laughs> campaign. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, like things like that. Yeah, that's my very very simple. Fantasy. Can Can you guys role play? Like, how do you feel about role playing? Oh, I think it's hot. I don't mind being yeah, it's a hot, it's hot, yeah. girl. Really. I think it's like fucking like I cannot say yeah, like if like I'd be like hello sir uh, what would you like like I cannot I would laugh I what cannot. What do you mean I will play as a bunny before? Oh, what, like, wait wait wait. He's like a bunny furry. then the the guy is what? I don't know. A, a, a bunny like, hunter. Oh, okay. I wore a bunny suit. Oh. Whoa, yeah, maybe it's a like furry? A... Or... No 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 it's just a bunny you know like Playboy. Yeah. Oh mm. cute. Also quite sexy. But like do you have script? No but I feel like guys you don't, you don't want a pawn show man. No but I feel like guys don't play along eh. It's like sometimes I do want to do role play right But I feel like the guys don't play along It's like oh yeah yeah mm, yeah oh hi <laughs> You know what I mean? Or like you pretend, you pretend like, not to know your partner Like it's the first night you meet oh, yeah, them yeah, yeah, like yeah. hi And then you use a fake name some shit like oh that Oh my god This is kind of yeah, hard like, Right? <laughs> <laughs> yes yes Have you ever recorded yourself before? Yes. Yes. Really? Never. Oh, oh my god, my god. Yeah. Shit. Yes. You so, were... Nope, never. You were... Never. You were... Never. Never thought of it. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we've come to the end of this episode of Keeping It Real, Love and Sex Intertwined. Um, any last final thoughts about, you know, sex equals love or like, you know... Sex, can you have sex without sex love? Sex something love. What? I Is think it? you can have sex without love. But you cannot have love without sex. Right. 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 Yes. Well, Great. Kari? S A M E. Okay. <laughs> right. Poppy? It's not important, but it's a factor. Mm. Mm. Agreed? I mean, I, I mean. Sex something love. Like, what's the. In black, spill in the blanks. Sex something love. Yeah. Equal. Cool. In love, you need sex. <laughs> in sex. You might not need love. Right. Which yeah. is similar. Yeah, I just rephrased what Sam said. <laughs> <laughs> the quote of the day. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Sam. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll bring it at home. <laughs> right. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this episode. Uh, my name is Emily. I'm Michelle. Kimberly. Poppy. Corinne. Sam. And we'll see you guys next week on the last episode of Keeping It Real Season 1. Woo! Bye.